Assalamualaikum. My name is Siti Syamimi Syaira binti Muhammad Miladi. Hello. Nurul Nasara binti Jamila Aisyah. So today we're going to talk about NFT and trade and cash discount. But let me explain to you just about NFT first. What is the concept of NFT? NFT is a special concept used by financial firm to offer an investment or a loan. So let's look at the first question. Okay, let's start with the first question. Lee Min Ho bought a subsale house for 210,000. He paid a down payment of 10% of the house price. So, 210,000 down payment of 10% is A. He then signed an agreement with Bank National to borrow the balance amount with an interest rate of 3.2%. Interest rate is G. Compound monthly. Compound monthly, as we know, monthly is 12. And make a payment at the end of every month for 30 years. 13 years is a term. So, the question 1, calculate the monthly installment that Limino has to pay every month. So, monthly installment is R. So, we need to find R. After we got all the information, we just insert it into the formula. This, this is all the information that we got. So, the formula that we need to use is A equal to R multiplied by 1 minus 1 plus I power negative N divided by I. So, the final answer is 817.36 ringgit. Let's move to the next question. How much did Lee Min Ho actually pay for the subsell and the interest charge? So, for the subsell, we need to find the RN and then after we got the RN, we need to find the I. So, at the first question, we already got the answer for R. So, we just use E to insert in the RN formula. So, the answer for RN is 294,000 so we should use i equal to rn minus a and finally we got the answer as the 105,200 question if Lee Min Ho failed to pay for the first three months the month calculate the amount he has to pay on first payment in order to settle the outstanding payment so n is 4 t is 12 the m is 0 0.032 and this R is 817.36 so we have to substitute into SN equals to R 1 plus I the power of N minus 1 over I so we substitute the information as 4 817.36 and 1 plus 1 plus sorry 1 plus 0 0.032 over 12 and the power of 4 minus 1 over 0 0.032 over 12 so the answer is as stated in the question, find the center balance of the house with a single payment of 250 payment. So, so if you draw a timeline, you will get 360 minus 280 equal to 80. And we can use formula AN equal R bracket 1 minus 1 plus I negative N per I close bracket. Next, you can just substitute the information on the formula which is a activity equal to a one seven point three six bracket y minus one plus zero point three two per twelve plus bracket power of negative eighty divided by zero point zero three two divided by twelve and close the bracket. And the answer A A T equal to five A one four point three zero. I will talk about the meaning of trade and cash discount. Firstly, trade discount is deduction from the list price rate and expressed as the percentage of the list price. Meanwhile, cash discount is percentage deduction of the price on the invoice or monthly statement of the sales. If the payment is made within a specific period of time. Okay. Today, I will teach about how to solve question 2 for A and B. As stated, the question is Mr. Dumbledore, a stationary shop owner, sold the following products to a teacher center. As you can see in this table, 
Mr. Dumbledore offered trade discount of 12%, 8%, and 5% for the sales. The invoice date, 20 February 2020, was issued with a cash term of 6 per 15, 5 per 30, and per 90, and a transportation cost of 200. For the question A, the single trade discount equivalent to the trade discount given. So, we need to find R. To find R, R equals 1 minus multiply 1 minus D1, multiply 1 minus D2, and lastly, multiply 1 minus D3. So, we can get 1 minus multiply 1 minus 0 1, 0 0.12, multiply 1 minus 0 0.08, multiply 1 minus 0 0.05. After the calculation, we get 0 0.23088. And for this answer, we need to change it into percent. So just multiply with 100. So you can get the final answer with 23.09%. Okay, next we move on to the question B. Question B is to find the total net amount of all items. So we need to find net price. Formula for net price is MP equal LP. This price, LP is equal this price. Multiply 1 minus R1, R is red. Multiply 1 minus R2, and multiply 1 minus R3. So we can take out the information from, the, from this question. And the answer for this price is 2600. To get that answer, you need to multiply list price per unit in the table with quantity of all items, which is 7 ringgit multiplied by 35, 6 ringgit multiplied by 50, 50 ringgit multiplied by 10, 4 ringgit multiplied by 25, and lastly, 10 ringgit multiplied by 30. So, the total list price you will get is 2,600. After that, you just substitute the answer into the formula, which is 2,600 2, multiplied 1 minus 0 0.12, multiplied 1 minus 0 0.08, multiplied 1 minus 0 0.05, and the final answer is 1,999.71 cents. That's it. Let's move to the question C. So the question wants us to find the last day to receive a 5% cash discount. So, 5% discount in average 13 days if you do the timeline. So, here. So, how to find it? We need to do this method. 20 of February 2022 plus 3, 30 days. So, First, we need to identify that this is the leap year or not. So, 2020 is a leap year. So, February must be in my 20 of 29th of February. So, this method can help us to find the last day of the, the last day to receive the 5% discount. So, after then we use this method, we can get the final answer. So, the final answer is 21st of March 2020. Both on 15 March. So, we have to find the date and the number of date. Date so 20 to 20 of February is 9. 1 to 15 of March is 15 days. So if you apply on calculator, it's 24 days. So we have to draw a timeline that 15 days is 6%. 15 days, so it means 6%. So we have NP 1 minus C. So we apply the answer N of NP 1999.71 1, 1 minus 0 0.06 is 1879.73.